I am standing here with PGA professional Chris Rogers, and we are in Aloha. Um, and we're about, what, 30 minutes out of Portland? About 30 minutes west of Portland, yes. Yeah, and we're at the Reserve Vineyards and Golf Club. Correct. The Reserve is a 36-hole golf facility. We have 18 holes that are dedicated to the public, and we also have 18 holes that are private. From the 1st to the 15th of the month, our North Course, which was designed by Robert Cup, is the private side. And then on the 16th of the month, the designation changes to the South Course being private. Both courses offer uh, a wide variety of challenges for the person who's just getting into the game, junior golfers, women, as well as the most advanced players who, who uh, like the challenge of a championship style course. And, and both courses are, are very different in design. The, the north course is, is more of a link style course with rolling hills and, and more target oriented for, for golfers, whereas the south course, the course that we're standing on right now, is a little bit longer, a little more tree lined, a lot more bunkers. The south course has over a hundred bunkers strategically placed throughout the uh, throughout the layout so it's uh, it's nice if you come out here you can actually uh, utilize all the clubs in your bag and really get a good experience. Nice well I love your clubhouse it's absolutely gorgeous I know you guys have some different events there too people come out here for weddings. Absolutely we're not not just a golf course we have we have extensive uh, meeting areas and uh, venues that can be used outdoors for uh, weddings for large group gatherings for tournaments uh, and we also have a number of indoor uh, facilities as well that can be used for uh, events especially in the winter time. Every Wednesday night in the summertime our uh, vintage room deck just right outside of our restaurant Beautiful is, deck. is, uh, is uh, from 6 to 9 each we have live music every Wednesday. So, you know we offer breakfast, lunch and dinner service in the in the summertime and, and Chef Shane Chandrel and, and his staff do a great job of preparing food with locally sourced uh, products and, and uh, the service, everything that we strive to do is to give you a great experience. And the wine is more of a, a theme for us. We, we have grapes out front, but uh, we actually work with some of the local wineries to, to uh, produce our house labels. Great. Well, I'm excited to check out the course a little bit. We're going to get in the cart. You're going to show me something. Yes. I don't guarantee I can do it, All but right. I will try because you're a professional. All right. Um, so we're on the north course, right. which is different than the south course. That's right. Well, this is the, again, the north course is more of a link style course uh, in terms of the rolling hills, a lot more uh, long grass, target oriented. We're, we're standing here right now on what is fairly unique to the northwest, if not the whole country. This is a, this is a triple green complex where our, our first hole, our eighth hole, and our seventeenth hole all share the same the same putting green complex uh, the green surface is so large it's not going to impact play at all but at the same time it's it's unique to see all the holes kind of converge into into one area well the the reserve host has hosted a number of uh, events and tournaments over the over the 17 years that it's been open when we when we first opened in 1997 the following year we hosted the Fred Meyer challenge which is Peter Jacobson's event that he ran for a number of years here in, in Portland a number of tour players Arnold Palmer Jack Nicklaus just about a who's who of of, of golf has been out here. We also hosted a, a PGA event, the, the Gelled Wind Tradition, a senior uh, tour event, the Champions Tour from 2003 to 2006. So we've, we've been very fortunate to have hosted a number of, of large well-known events and, and uh, a number of, of people have been able to come out here and play. So for myself, who's never ever golfed before, you're gonna show me something today. Right. I don't know if I'll be able to hit a ball. Hit it really hard. Okay. Got all it. I have to do is hit it. All okay. you have to do is, is well, all you have to do is swing. Okay. okay. It doesn't mean I'm gonna that, hit it. That's right. There oh, I got to go. hit it. You got it. Yeah. Nice shot. I'm a golfer. <laughs> oh my god, I hit the ball. There you go. Harder than it looks. <laughs> it is harder than it looks. Take some practice. Take some time. But wow. uh, it's definitely worth it to be out here and to um, uh, be with your friends, be outside. It's there's so many benefits to playing. It's, awesome. Thank you. Thank you. This is such a lovely golf course. Um, I know that y you guys are very community oriented. Yes. Um, and the owners are very hands-on. Yes, uh, we've we've been fortunate. We've had the same owner for the 17 years we've been open. He's very committed to this 
uh, community and, and uh, the service that we try to provide not only to the people who are here but to the city of, of Hillsboro, Aloha, Beaverton, the, all, all of the local areas. It's a, it's a great place to be and we're, we're, we're fortunate to be here. I really like golfing. I might just have to take it up. All right, thank you. Thank you, Chris. Thank I'm gonna you. go get something to eat now in the clubhouse because right, I've worked up an appetite. So. All right, thank you for being on Oregon Lifestyles. All right, thank you for having me.